it's all jail. Yeah. Second floor is the attorney's office. It's attorney's offices and some meeting spaces, and then we're, you'll see a big chunk of the second floor is all mechanical, all the air handlers and boilers and everything else in there. So you have some stuff on the roof and some on the second floor. And courthouse is up? The courthouse, the courthouse will be on the third floor, so yep. And how many courtrooms? Three new courtrooms. This right here is gonna be the entry point. So we'll walk in through where the entry doors are gonna be. It's gonna be a single entry. We're gonna have security in here. It's just, it's unfortunately, it's just gonna be a secure building totally. Um, metal, you know, law enforcement right here. So once you get past this place, then at least we know people aren't carrying a weapon in, in the courthouse. So it, it's further than their front entrance now, and not very much further, but I get it if you're, if you're mobility challenge, it's a little bit further to go. So sidewalk will come right to here from the parking sure. lot. So on the next two floors, these will be public, big public restrooms over in this corner and then above it. This will just kind of be a entryway. And then the elevators will be right here. And since it doesn't match up exactly to the old building, you're gonna have a 1A and a 1B and a 2A and a 2B. So depending on where you wanna go, but. So that's like, we'll knock that out and that's a, that'll be the hallway into the existing building. So we had to have this little transition space just because the elevation just wouldn't match up. This is the county attorney space right here, walled in already. So there'll be offices on the external cubicles in the middle. So, and the offices are actually a little smaller than average, but we're gonna fit a lot of people in here. There'll be two larger training rooms, meeting rooms in here, and right in between the two training rooms will just be a little hallway and, a, and restrooms. And then kind of where that elevator shaft is, over that way and in that back corner, that's all boilers and, and air handlers and that type of thing. So it'll just be securely walled off and locked off. And Now that elevator, is that for the jail system? Yep, that's a secure for the inmate transfer. Yep, up to the yep. courthouse and yep. back down. And so this will just be a big open hallway and these will all be nice big windows. And then three different courtrooms. And they won't be this big because the back half will be some judges' chambers and uh, hallways and you know other offices, but they'll be. This will be the largest one. So we have a big jury trial or something, and each one will have little side rooms right off front before you actually get into the jury room. So if you need to have attorney-client, you know, conversations and that type of thing. Right. And the jury room will be bigger than it is now. Yep, they're, they'll be in the back. The jury rooms. Oh, they're very tiny. <laughs> yep. Right now. Very small right now. Right in there where that the concrete block is, that'll be an inmate holding. Because right now, if they put court on a recess or something, they got to take them back over to jail, put them back in their cell. And now they'll just stick them right in there securely and just wait till it's their turn. Yeah. So this will be the last courtroom. Even though it looks like it's the smallest, it's still larger than any courtroom we have right now. And that whole back area is office staff and judges' judges' chambers. 